So is it possible to embed a file from OneDrive onto Firefly and then have people editing it whilst it's embedded? Well, sadly, the answer to that is no. And the only sort of work around for it is this way. You could have a file embedded in Firefly and then you could edit it in OneDrive and then users can refresh the page in Firefly and they should see the changes. So let's see if I can do that with this particular file here. It's a help sheet. If I go to Firefly, here it is here, it's embedded uh, and this is in view only or read only. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some changes to uh, the title here uh, and I'm going to do those in my OneDrive account and see when I refresh this page, do the changes happen. Right, so here I am. I'm just going to edit it online. I'm going to edit it inside OneDrive rather than editing it on my laptop and up, loading it again. So I click on here and I'm going to select open and open in Word online. Now the good thing about editing in Word Online is you don't have to save it. So the moment you make a change, those uh, um, the changes are saved. So I'm going to edit document, edit in Word Online, and we'll see all the various tools that will appear soon on the menu bar. And it's very similar to Word. Now remember, I don't have to have Word installed to be able to do this editing. So here is my title. Uh, I'm going to highlight it and I think I might change the color. Let's just use some simple changes to red and I'm going to change the word one, uh, the number one to the word one. I'm going to add in Firefly like that. And I think that's probably enough changes. If you can see down at the bottom, it's saving it. And then what I'm going to do then is I'm going to go out of Word Online. I'm just going to go back to my OneDrive area. There we go. Here is my file that I've made the changes to. And it will take a moment and you should see the changes appear in OneDrive. Let me just refresh the page. There you go. So the question is, have the changes happened here? Well, I have to refresh. I can either press F5 on the keyboard or I can press the refresh icon to reload the page. Here we go. Reloading the page. Here is Word Online. And there we go. So I have edited the embedded file, which is the only way that you can do it. Unfortunately, you cannot put in a file in OneDrive and have users openly change it in there. The only way to do that is to do it using a Google document uh, and I'll show you that in a later video.